that I was pregnant, you have been avoiding me like a plague. Slept together, remember? Hmm? It doesn't matter. You actually leave the house really early, hang out with the boys till late, and then you leave before I even wake up. You know what? If you are tired of this relationship, you can just tell me. It's not by force. No, I don't have time for all this. I told you being pregnant was fine. I told you that. Then tell your parents. I don't want to raise their hopes up. I beg your pardon? So I don't want to raise their hopes up. You don't want to raise their hopes up. I knew it! I knew it! You think I'm lying! That's why you barely even looked at the pregnancy test! In fact, you discarded the pregnancy test because you were horny! <laughs> Stop laughing! It's not funny! Sorry. It's not funny, Aminu. You're such a coward. You are a coward, Aminu Karma. You are a foolish coward. You know what? You don't have the balls to ask me if I'm pregnant. Alright. Alright. Now tell me. You really pregnant? Actually, you really need to know. Did you just ask me that? By the time you come back, I will not be here. And when you want to know the truth, you have my number. I didn't ask for this. I just asked the question like you said I should ask. That's all. But it's okay. If you insist on going, it's fine. I'll send you some money so you can get it. Just call Patrick, all right? I'll see you later. Today my birthday. You would know if it was your birthday, wouldn't you? Anyway, I made sausages and eggs and I made pancakes and I also used honey instead of syrup, just as you like it. Oh. What? Why is your face like this? Nothing. <laughs> Naomi, please. What do you want from me? Why would I want anything? I made breakfast for my husband. <laughs> 
is also going to be true. Look, just tell me, what do you want from me so I can just go to work? I don't want anything. I have everything I need right here. Okay? So please, eat the food. So anyway, I was talking to my friend Valerie. And she was saying how her husband is donating one million naira to a charity. So I was thinking that, you know, maybe I should just tell you about it. Um, why are you telling me this? Because I don't want anyone to upstage us. Like, maybe we should, you know, donate about five million naira. What? what? Five million naira? Yes, sir. You want us to donate five million naira to upstage someone at a charity event? But daddy pays us enough, so we can afford it. First of all, there is no us. And second of all, this is a very expensive breakfast, I should have known. Think that I'm not, I'm not eating this. Think about the children, we're saving children's lives. Think about the children. Are you thinking helping? about these children? But, am I not the one asking for the donation? Do you know what your problem is? Go on. You have never worked a day in your single life for money. That's why I kept opening your mouth saying, five million naira, five million naira, as if it's chicken change. Now you, you should be ashamed of yourself. If you uh, want that money, go and ask your father. Uh-uh. Tunde, bring the money on. Can you just We need stop. the money. Can we you need the money stop? for the charity. It's only five million. I don't I'm even know done. what he's doing. He's even strong in face. What are you strong in face for? Bring that money on. Sorry for coming with your highness. So, can I get you breakfast? Well, it depends on what you're offering. And what if I'm offering myself? In that case, do you come with butter or jam? <laughs> Hello, Cynthia. Yeah, please, can you get breakfast for Hadiza and myself? and push all my meetings. If anything is work related, just get someone else in the office to handle it. Yeah. Thank you. Wow. I do feel special. Well, you are VIP. Okay, let's hope that VIP status ensures that I get out of here by dinner time. <laughs> Only if I'm buying you dinner. Well, I never say no to food. Shall we get on with work? Yes, we shall. The way that you whine, the way that you whine, the way that you move, I'm like in a door. Who be this one again? Ah, the door is open, come in. Right. So you're going to pretend like you're not happy to see me? I didn't miss you, kid. Ah, oh, come on. Of course I do. I miss you. Hmm? You like? You're bribing me away. You're bribing me with all these fine, fine do things. Do you like it? Hey, if you ask, <laughs> more money on thought. <laughs> Where's your brother asking where you get all this money from? I'm a good saver with nice friends. Really? I'm a nice friend, Abby. Mm -hmm. I'm the only friend. I'm very good. Hello. Flaky. Brother. Bounty. Mm, nothing much. Uh, Mom just said she gave you something for me. Eh, she did, but. Eh, but you know. She could see. Right, right, brother. Anyways, I'll be there in a bit. Maybe in another 30 minutes. Ah, no, you can't come to my house right now. I'm collecting anything. <laughs> Don't be my teen again. Hey, I have lectures. Maybe after after school, I'll bring it and drop it in your house. I'll even come with Shadi. Ah, uh, okay, it's fine. You can give it to her to bring. 
Okay, brother. Bye bye. <laughs> it's like you want him to catch us at me. Don't worry, I'll take full responsibility. Responsibility, Guinea. You you that have a wife and small, small girls everywhere. I'm suspecting you, you and that Auntie Lola. <laughs> No, let's let's go let's go somewhere special. Hmm? No, let's stay here. You give me the money. Really? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anything my baby wants, my baby gets. What? No. Imagine, I told him that I was pregnant and he didn't even come back to try and beg me. I am not going to let Amilu insult me like this. No. Why does the baby even have to be his own? Why can't you just get me pregnant and then we can still use it to get what we want? Fine. But just know that I am tired of this. I really am. Let's just make sure we do everything for the small sizes to serve the masses, huh? That's the plan, sir. I'll have the bank finance the loan. We deserve a new warehouse. We'll do for an expansion, right? So, it's just... Problem, sir. It's good. All right, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I just hope that her mouthfuls will not see this one and rip it off again. I don't care, they can rip off whatever it is they want to rip off. All right, the customers will always buy original products if they are very cheap and affordable, all right? I really don't care. Sir, uh... I know this is none of my business, but have you told your family about Jasmine's pregnancy? No. Well, don't you think that mm. you should? You're right. It's none of your business. I apologize. Thank you. Just lock the door behind you, sir. Talking to Shadi yet? Yeah, we're kind of cool. She's upset about something, but I can't just figure out what. And the cougar? A bad on the other hand. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> <laughs> Guy, I thought I was in control, but man, I'm in trouble. Because like, of Shadi? No jokes, yeah. Guy, oh. you know I love women. You know that one. Because that's but I, I wish I could have all of them, but that's mm. not even the point. I don't think it's as long as you are not married. Enjoy your life. <laughs> that's just, that's just I, me, man. I don't know. Ah, I don't that's, know. that's how me I see it. I, I, I could try. I'm good. Why are you so happy? Because my life is great. <coughs> White long face. What's wrong with this guy? <sighs> he cheated on Shadi and he's not sure he can control it. I beg this Shadi baby. Why would you be dating someone like Shadi? She's my girlfriend. She's a student. Dude, <laughs> date a babe that will spoil you the maturity. Hmm? Really? Mm -hmm. You don't want to talk? Thank you. Kenny, I mean. <laughs> I mean, they exactly my the most mature person, so you shouldn't be the one giving advice. Mm. That's stupid. You <laughs> know. Anyway, look, you should see the woman in my life. How do you Will you go out with me? Tyra, look, I I really don't like to mix business with pleasure. But we've been talking every night this week. Still. I know that I'm being straightforward. And I know that I'm married. But there's something about you that makes me feel different. Okay, um... Maybe we can do it tonight. Pick it, please. <laughs> well, I think my house will be the safest option. Give me time, give me a day, and I'll be there on time. <laughs> You're so
so beautiful. That's good for you. Hmm? Hmm? That's good for your life. <laughs> Larry, look at me. Live your life to the fullest. Enjoy your life. Leave women out of That's it. That's why I told him. Yeah, Just yeah. enjoy your life. Except, except for the leave women part. Enjoy your life. <laughs> Where's that mean, sir? I don't know. I don't know what that means. It's supposed to be here by the end. Hey. What's going on? What is it now? At the charity thing now. I was thinking I would see you, but I saw Naomi and now it's just like <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I'm now. This guy from Ghana, but why would you marry fear itself? Does it make sense? Chasing money makes you make the craziest decisions. So I, I think he's going to need a room tonight. Absolutely. you. your room for Mr. Alala for he's going to be needing it tonight. Yes. It's <laughs> Thank you. It's Thank, you. Thank you very much. Okay, how do you know he's going to be needing a room? <laughs> You'll find out soon. Wait, why did you tell me this was vodka? This is this is not vodka. to apologize earlier. Apology accepted. <laughs> Shadi, what are you doing here? Are you expecting someone else? No. I've been trying to call you. I thought we were done fighting. Yeah, I thought so too. Until I saw you having fun with Mrs. Lawson. Have some of my chicken. It will calm you down. So what do you think? Oh? So what is it then? Tribute to an artist Tribute to the one with a voice Tribute to the brightest singer For whose life will always rejoice We know it's over We've walked the line And came through the mess But we've got our father On whose shoulders we can mess 
Cause you know we love you So where did you go to so long? We'll never forget you Hold tight to the memories of you This can't be the ending Was only beginning so long And you know we loved you So where did you go to so long? So the battle was raging, but we fought the fight and came through the mess. You were a comrade, it's hard to say goodbye to the best. We'll all come together to honor the life you have led. No tears, no regrets, no, no, just smiles and lots of prayers. Cause you know we love you, so we 